Good morning children. Today we are going to start the new chapter. Chapter 8. Measurement. What is measurement? To measure the length and measure the weight and measure the capacity. Which all of this we measure length? Yes, you are on height. And which all the things you measure the weight? Yes, you were on body weight. And you which all measure the capacity? The capacity means you measure the liquid things like water, milk, kerosene, oil. Before that, we are going to study which is the biggest, smallest, heaviest, lightest, and some of this which contain more, which contain less, which is longest, how tall, how heavy and all. Take your textbook, page number 127. The first one. These are my handprints at different ages. Circle the biggest one. Which is the biggest one? Bigger circle. Yeah, this one is bigger. Circle it. And pick the smallest one. Which is the smallest? Yes. Next. Circle the heaviest one. These are my favorite toys. Circle the heaviest one. And pick the lightest one. Which is the heaviest? Heavier. More weight that can not carry heavy. See which one is heaviest? Yes, these are the toys. These are not original. If it is original, you may say this elephant is heavier. Yes, now which one is heavier? Do you feel? Yes. Yeah, this one is heavier. Only because these are toys. And which one is lightest? Yes, this ball. Next, I drink these every day. Circle the one that holds the most. Most means more. Which contain more? The first one. And pick the one that holds the least. This one. These are my clothes at different ages. Circle the longest one. It is longer, more length, bigger. This one is the longest. Pick the shortest. Yes, this is the smallest. Then take the next page. Page number 127. Now we are going to check how long, how long use your digit means your finger to measure the length of each crayon. You can use your finger like this and measure 1, 2, 3. According to me this is 3 digit. You check according to yourself and write like this way you can measure 1. 2, 3. See, you get half and all. Yes. 1, 2. Actually, this is 2 and some more. So, we can write it is 2. Yes. And this one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. The length of this crayon according to my digit is 5. Dash is longest. Which one is longest? The longer one. Yeah. The third one. Which one? Blue. The crayon and blue is longer and longest. And dash is the shortest. Which is the shortest? The yellow. 
Next one. We can also use hand span, hand span, foot span or pace to measure length. What is the length for each? See, this is arm span. You stretch your hands at both sides. This is called the arm span. Say, arm span. And your classroom, is it able to measure the classroom now? No. So, you please have all the questions. Next, your table is about dash. See, you stretch your hand. You stretch your hand, the distance from this smaller finger to this thumb finger. It is called the hand span. It is called the hand span. You can take your study table and measure. The teacher's table also not possible to measure nowadays. And the next one is your cupboard is about dashed foot span. Foot span. See the length from the toy to the hip. Toy to the hip. Your cupboard is about dash hand, foot span. You can measure your cupboard using the foot span. The door. Also you can measure the door. The door is about the dash foot span. And next from the classroom door to your seat. This is also not able to measure what does a pace. You stand up and fix your left leg on, on the floor and move your right leg forward. The distance between the left and the right leg, this much distance, it is called the pace. So we study the four things. The first one is arm span and hand span and foot span and pace. Then today's class is over. Thank you.